PDF is an important document for many businesses, but the softwares for editing PDF can be costly. Hey, what up Decisive Marketers? Today, I'm going to be talking about UPDF, which is a very affordable PDF editor, right? Um, and it can do a lot of things, but you know, let me just kind of jump in, right? Because PDF editor, I guess everyone knows about it, right? So before I dive into UPDF, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you like to see more digital marketing and e-commerce content, right? So here we go. So the good thing about UPDF, this is actually, you know, my resume, um, but I'm just going to use that as a example, right? But before I jump into UPDF, right? So uh, UPDF is a desktop application as well as a mobile application, right? So you can use it to edit PDFs on your desktop or mobile. Okay, so this is my resume right here. Um, Okay, so the good thing about UPDF is that they also have this, uh, you know, UPDF cloud. Um, I don't actually know what that is yet. Let me just kind of uh, see if I can jump into that. Okay, UPDF. So I guess you can save documents on there right um so what happens is it seems like you can save uh, pdf documents on the updf cloud uh, that's kind of nice so uh so this is the reader so of course you don't you don't do much with it okay you can uh you know recognize text using ocr okay you have to download the ocr plugin okay which you know we'll come to that later on um ocr is pretty much uh i can't remember what, what you call it but you know you can select a section and then it pulls out the text from it right okay and then you can export the pdf you can protect it you can share this file as, to others as well um and you can have it as a slideshow so that's kind of nice okay so let me just come jump back in okay let's uh you can leave comments um so you can put comments in here uh if you want to okay uh you can highlight that's very nice uh you have strike through okay you have underline uh, so you can underline important sections as well you can what is squiggly so you can say uh you know this is kind of sort of squiggly under uh, lines uh, you know under your text so uh that's kind of nice so you can put text comment as well so you can type stuff in there you can put a text box all right so you might want to change the color so you know you can have something like this you can draw on it as well with the pencil you can have erasers to remove them okay and then you can add like rectangles you can what other yeah you can there's other shapes as well you can choose from right you can choose the opacity as well uh you can put arrows you can add stickers as well so that's kind of nice right you can put stickers like emojis arrows something more interesting and then you can use your company stem here as well so uh you can put a stem here right you can put your own custom stem right so that's nice so if you need a company stem you can do that as well and then of course your signature you can create a signature and just kind of put that in okay so let's say this is my signature i can just put that in okay um so you can edit Okay, so you can edit the the text here as well. So you can move, you can even move the text. That's kind of nice. And the images, so you can, I guess, can move the images as well, right? And then you can change, you can add links, I guess. So you can link to say my website. So you can put like a button, I guess, 
Um, so that's what it does and then you can organize pages I guess, so I guess you can split them up you can move them around uh, so that's because this is a one page resume and then you can crop the page as well um, like this so if you want to do that uh, so I think this is this and then the last one will be so don't apply and what is this I can put watermarks as well on my PDF and uh, or on the background I can change the background I can put a header and footer as well so this is UPDF um, I would think that the features um, wise is not as detailed as cool new PDF which I've reviewed before but you know uh, it has a much better UI um, you know yes OCI inbuilt it has uh, you know for example for cool new PDF you can you can switch um, you know the files into many you can you sort of edit them into uh, convert them into many many different kind of uh, document formats as well right and image formats a lot of things that you can do with it but of course with UPDF you know there's much nicer UI um, it is also usable on mobile right so I think that's where the 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 benefits of uh, UPDF is right so I guess that's all I have to share about the uh, UPDF if you enjoyed this video do give me a thumbs up let me know what you think about UPDF in the comments below lastly if you know anyone who can benefit from UPDF be sure to share this video with them I'll see my next video bye bye